Well, this just in. Houston police say that a customer who shot and killed a robber at a local taqueria last week will now face a grand jury. Fox 26's Natalie, he is joining us live tonight from Houston Police Headquarters with this new information. Natalie. Jonathan, that's right. We're told that customer and his attorney came into HPD headquarters today to speak with detectives. That customer was asked to come in by investigators for questioning after surveillance re video revealed that he shot the robber at least nine times. Surveillance video from the Taqueria on South Gessner in Bel Air captures the terrifying moments an armed robber stormed into El Ranchito around 11.30 last Thursday night. The robber is seen pointing a gun at customers eating and stealing their money. This patron on the left pulled out his own gun and fired a total of nine shots at the robber, shooting even after the robber fell to the ground and his weapon was taken away. It was then that the shooting patron appeared to realize the gun was fake as he angrily threw the weapon against the wall. On Monday, Houston police revealed the case will be turned over to a grand jury to determine if the customer will face any criminal charges. Under Texas law, that doesn't change his right to act if there's apparent danger. Legal analyst Casey Garrett believes the customer was acting in self-defense and had every right to keep firing until the threat was neutralized. The important thing to remember is once somebody has the legal right to act in self-defense and to use lethal force in self-defense, then they have the right, <laughs> uh, whether it's shooting him once or shooting him nine times. And as long as you're acting in self-defense and it's not now become some attenuated intentional act of actually, you know, right. killing somebody, as long as he's acting under the right to defend himself or others. Authorities say the robber died on the scene. The Harris County Medical Examiner has now identified him as 30-year-old Eric Eugene Washington. Records say Washington was out on bond when he committed the robbery. And right now, the customer's identity is not being revealed because he's not being arrested or charged. Again, all that will be determined by a Harris County grand jury. From HPD headquarters, Natalie He, Fox 26 News.